So, look, we have something to talk about right away. And I've been wanting to do this. I've been wanting to make a video since I actually got home, like maybe an hour and 15 minutes ago, but been caught up with some things and didn't actually get to make the video to react to the FA Cup fourth round draw. I think it's the fourth and fifth round, but we are going to find out right about now. We are going to find out live, live right now, who got who. I did get a spoiler, though. I did get a... I hate these. You know what? You know what? I don't know. ESPN. I have the ESPN app, and it just keeps sending me these notifications, man. I hate spoilers. And then I see somebody in the chat, you know, spoiling the thing again. Liverpool got Man United. I, I, I'm like, oh, man, why, why spoil it? Why spoil it? But that's the only one I saw. So Liverpool, Man United, oh, man. The other day, I tuned into the Coppish channel, and the guys were actually saying, I bet we get a Premier League team next, next round. I bet. And, yeah, Liverpool actually did get a Premier League team. And not just the Premier League team. Not just any Premier League team, but arch nemesis, Manchester United. <laughs> what a draw. What a draw. And what we're going to do right now, we're going to take some time to react to the FA Cup fourth and fifth round draw. I think that's what it is. Not 100% sure, but I have it queued up here already. And we're just going to click this and I'm going to see what's going on. I haven't seen the draw yet. I don't even know who City has. Don't tell me, please. Let me find out on my own. Let's go. Okay, Google search fourth and fifth round draw. The Guardian. Let's use the article from, you know what? Uh, let, let's use the FA. Let's see what the FA got here. Let, 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 let's take the official source, the FA. Okay, I like this. I like this one. So I'm, I'm going to make this big so you guys could see. And we're going to talk about this right about now. So come on, please don't spoil it. I told you not to spoil it. Freaking Dimitri Paye. Don't spoil it, man. God damn. Anyways, the draws for both the fourth and fifth rounds of the Emirates FA Cup were made on Monday evening following last weekend's third round action. Hosted by Reshman Chowdhury and conducted by Peter Crouch, both draws were made back-to-back -to, -back to aid with fixture scheduling and form part of BT Sports' pre-match coverage of the third round tie between Stockport County and and West Ham United, as well as on the official Emirates FA Cup YouTube channel. The fourth and fifth rounds are due to take place over the weekend of January 23rd and Wednesday the 10th of February, respectively, and match dates and kickoff will be confirmed in due course following discussions with clubs, broadcasters, and local authorities. Ah, I, I kind of could read, you know. I kind of could read, you know. But these are the draws. Let, let, me, let, me, let, me, let me use the freaking down arrow to get each draw so I don't get spoilers. Cheltenham Town versus Manchester City. Hmm. 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 <laughs> I like that. I like that. I like that. Listen, man. Oh, man. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. But City always gets some type of easy draw. I don't know what it is, man. Seriously, I don't know what kind of four-leaf clover the City boss got in his pocket. But always get lucky with draws. But Cheltenham Town versus Manchester City for the fourth round, okay? The fifth round would be like the winner of this match versus the winner of that. So we're going to find that out soon. Next one, we have AFC Bournemouth versus Crawley Town. Crawley Town, giant killers, man. They knocked out Leeds United. So Bournemouth, watch yourself. Watch yourself. But going back to the Man City draw, could Cheltenham actually be giant killers? I, I doubt it, man. I think Cheltenham knocked out Mansfield. Their game went to extra time. I think I was tuning into that game a little bit. A wee bit. I was. Okay? 
So let's go down. Swansea City versus Nottingham Forest. Manchester United versus Liverpool. Woo-hoo-hoo. I love it. I absolutely love that one. That one, I have to say, I love. I love it, man. Big up to everybody in here right now, though. I love that one. I love that one. Make sure you smash the thumbs up button on the video one time. I love that one. I love that one. How unlucky, though, for Liverpool. They drew Villa, which was not a kind draw, seeing that Villa got the 7-2 win at Villa Park and all. And then Liverpool got kind of lucky. Wink, wink. And the Aston Villa first team couldn't play. So there was actually mm, the same thing that happened to Liverpool last season with the with, with the um, EFL Cup semi-final where Villa actually played Liverpool's U team. The same thing happened to Liverpool. So that's what it is. You know, what goes around comes around. It's called karma. And Aston Villa got, got a taste of that where Liverpool smashed the Utes. Could have been by more, but, you know, not a very convincing performance, and I maintain that. Manchester United versus Liverpool. It will be at Old Trafford. We know the type of record that Liverpool had at Old Trafford, so, you know, it, it's not a nice draw. It is not a nice draw. Let's see how it work out. You know, maybe things could turn, turn around for the better for Liverpool in terms of the FA Cup and the Carabao Cup. Next, Southampton versus Strawsbury Town versus Arsenal. Okay, so Southampton will play one of Strawsbury Town versus Arsenal. Why? Why did Southampton have to play one of the two? I don't get it. I don't get it. Did South oh did Southampton's fixture get postponed or something? I don't even know. Seriously. I don't even know, and I'm not going to try to figure it out right now. Maybe one of you guys could explain that right now in the comments, but I don't know. Barnsley versus Norwich. Charlie versus Wolves. Charlie, non-league Charlie, who has been on a remarkable run versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Millwall versus Bristol City. Brighton and Hove Albion versus Blackpool. Wickham Wanderers versus Tottenham Hotspur. Now, that's a mismatch. Wickham get in promotion to the championship for the first time in the history versus Tottenham. Mm. Mourinho would love that draw. Fulham versus Burnley. Sheffield United versus Plymouth Argyle. Chelsea versus Luton Town. That's a kind draw for Chelsea, to be honest. Stockport County or West Ham United versus Doncaster Rovers. I'm still trying to figure out why it's Shrewsbury Town versus Arsenal or Southampton. I'm still trying to figure that one out. Seriously. Brentford versus Leicester City and Everton versus Sheffield Wednesday. All right, that's the fourth round. What, what's the... What's the um? Oh, Shrewsbury Town had a bunch of COVID-19 tests. But didn't Arsenal play in the FA Cup? Or was that, was that the League Cup? That Arsenal played in the last time I saw them. Hmm. Damn, I, I can't. No, it can't be. I can't even remember. To be a, no, didn't we beat? I can't, didn't we beat Arsenal? I, I can't even remember what's going on. Seriously. I can't even remember though. Seriously. Um, Southampton versus Shrewsbury was postponed. But why do they have it here to say, oh. I got it. I, I effed it up. It's Southampton or Strawsbury versus Arsenal. I read it Southampton versus Strawsbury. Ver I'm like, come on. Yeah, you see the way they have it written, right? They have it Southampton. I didn't read it properly. So it's Southampton or Strawsbury Town versus Arsenal. Now I get it. Because I'm like, what the hell are you talking about? Anyways, the fifth round will be. This is the fifth round draw. Officially the fifth round draw. This is what it is. So Fulham versus, well, Fulham or Burnley versus Bournemouth or Crawley Town. 
Man United or Liverpool versus Stockport or West Ham United or Downcaster Rovers. So Stockport and West Ham are playing right now as we speak. So it would be one of them two versus the West Ham versus Doncaster, Stockport versus Doncaster. And it most likely will be West Ham United. So whoever wins that will play West Ham United. That's how I think it, it will end. West Ham, sorry, Doncaster, but um, West Ham might actually come through there. Sheffield United or Plymouth Argyle versus Millwall or Bristol City. Shirley or... Wolverhampton Wanderers versus Southampton or Shrewsbury Town or Arsenal. Now I get it. Barnsley or Norwich versus Chelsea or Luton Town. So Chelsea got a pretty kind draw there. Chelsea got a kind draw going there for them again. Everton or Sheffield Wednesday versus Wickham or Tottenham. Swansea City or Nottingham Forest versus Cheltenham or Manchester City. I think that's another kind draw. Swansea, Nottingham Forest. Oh man, we will we we would make light work of them. Seriously, come on, it, it, it's too easy. Brentford or Leicester versus Brighton and Hove Albion or Blackpool. So there you have it. My FA Cup fourth and fifth round draw. Even though I messed up that Arsenal, um, Southampton, Shrewsbury thing, but because of you nice people in the comments, I was able to figure it out. So there you go. That's my reaction. And as a Man City fan, I'm I'm loving this. I'm absolutely loving the draw right about now. I'm loving it. You see what I mean? We have a path straight to the semis. Straight to the semis. Okay? So how are you guys feeling about the draw right about now? We have Thriller from Manila saying we beat Newcastle. We played a winner. Southampton versus Shrewsbury. That's an Arsenal fan. Do you watch NBA? No, I don't. What else we got here? Rivals fans cry. We get easy draws. Yeah, Dupe. They always cry, man. That's what it is. That is what it is. But that's the draw. That's the draw. I love it. What could I, what could I say? I love it. I don't know if Liverpool fans could say the same thing. But for me, as a City fan, I absolutely, absolutely love it.